Robotic surgery is a minimally invasive advanced form of endoscopic surgery. In the field of uh, ENT hernia surgery, when it is done through the mouth, it is called as transoral robotic surgery. It was developed by Dr. Bert O'Malley and Gregory Weinstein from in University of Pennsylvania and it is indicated for cancers of the tonsils, tongue base and uh, the upper part portion of the voice box. It can also be performed for early lesions, um, early cancers of the tonsil tongue base without subjecting the patients for uh, radiotherapy or chemotherapy. The other indication for transoral robotic surgery in the field of ENT is for parapharyngeal space tumors where you want to avoid uh, uh, incision in the neck. The advantage of transoral robotic surgery as compared to open surgery, in open surgery we need to use big incision with more surgical morbidity. Uh, Sometimes we need to split the jaws, split the uh, you know, tongue to access the tumors deeper inside the throat. Transoral robotic surgery, uh, we can minimize this invasive procedure by locally resecting the tumors with identification and preservation of the normal neurovascular structure. So the surgical morbidity is very less, the recovery is very early and the post-operative pain, bleeding will also be less as compared to open surgery. It started with uh, the transfer robotic surgery started with uh, removal of the early cancers of the tonsils, tongue base and uh, supraglottis otherwise called as the upper portion of the voice box uh, in which we can use uh, uh, the endoscope which comes with the robot which, is, which gives 10 times magnification with a 3D vision where the surgeon can clearly see the structures and remove the tumor. The advantages of uh, robotic surgery as compared to conventional surgery, when you identify those finer structures with a good magnification, uh, we can preserve the normal structures, we can differentiate the cancer tissue from the normal tissue. The other indication for robotic surgery in the field of ENT is for neck procedure where you want to, where you want to avoid a neck scar, especially in young and active members of the society with neck tumors, especially thyroid nodules, thyroid cancers, parathyroid tumors, branchial cysts, benign swelling of the neck and also neck dissections in patients with and neck cancers. This is called as a remote access robotic surgery where the scar is hidden behind the ear and this, the incision is taken behind the hair uh, crease, the hair line. So the scar is completely hidden. So especially for young male, females who are very active in the society who wants to avoid a neck scar, a visible neck scar. Uh, this is a good approach uh, with a robot remote access surgery.